So confirm that your patients have an infection through rising in their body temperature beyond 37.2 degrees, and that's what we call fever. That is except in immune compromised patients, and fever is not always specific for infection. It is associated also with allergy and cancer. So you can also confirm infection by complete blood count. The normal is from 5,000 to 11,000, and the neutrophil count from 40 to 60 percent. So they are raised in bacterial infections. The lymphocyte from 20 to 40 percent. They fight viruses and tuberculosis. The eosinophils from 1 to 4 percent. They are elevated in an allergy and parasitic infections. The monocyte is from 2 to 8 percent. They are elevated in infection, inflammation, and malignancy. And basophils, the normals from 0 to 1 percent, and they are elevated in blood disorders and malign malignancy. And you can also confirm infection by doing specific tests. If your patient is coughing, you can do a chest x-ray and so on.